Hi, welcome back guys. Um, just wanting to fill you in on what I have going on in my coop. Um, I have some removable nesting boxes here. I found that to be a great way to take them out, clean them, always keep it smelling fresh in here. If you have a broody hen, such as Jenny here, all you got to do is give them a little shake and the hen pops right out so you're not battling with that. And yeah, I just have a square hay bale here in front of the door. The door's open today. We finally got some warm weather. Um, yeah, just the roost. I do have a heating lamp. I know that's very controversial, but um, where we live, it gets really cold, like minus 40 degrees Celsius. So I don't want my chickens freezing. Therefore, we taped around the hook. We tied it up really good. Yes, my girls have a chandelier. So I do believe that we're safe here. It is secured very well. Um, I know it can be a risk, but I'm willing to take that because I don't want them to freeze. And yeah, there's my big boy Chubbs, and I just want to let you know what was going on in the coop. Hi, girls. We only get a few more warm days, so enjoy the outside while you can, I suppose. Are you excited to be outside? Sammy. Are you having fun? This is our stray. She just showed up one day. Someone dropped her off on the road. But she's ours now. We saved her. Oh, I thought I'd just show you guys around a bit. Um, we use an old stock trailer to keep hay in for our goats. Um, we actually got we repurposed this old fridge and freezer so that we can keep, you know, brushes, their hay nuts, feed, grain, mineral stuff like that and we also repurposed a um, tank holder and just cut out the bars and made it safe for them and that's where they eat their hay. Here's just a little bit more of our goat pen. Thought I'd show you guys. They love being up high. You can see more I guess. Goats will climb on anything. They're so funny. This little guy here, Lurch, he um, as soon as we built their shelter he jumped right on top of that roof. But we got their play area done and now they just go up there. So as you can see, I definitely have a mix of birds. I um, started out by getting a few chickens from family and friends and then we, you know, purchased some along the way. But it really all started with my rooster here. And uh, yeah, it's been a really great experience. I highly recommend getting chickens. It's been a lot of fun.